Yo, yo, what up, what up, what up, world? My name is Shaheen, bottom of brackets. I'm here with my cousin Guy, a.k.a. L.E.L. You know what I'm saying? G4 TV, Freestyle 101. We about to go in the booth and play our game. Hope y'all like it. Yo, what up, cuz? What's poppin', Sha? Yo, I just got this new game I'm about to introduce what? to the world. You know what I mean? My game is about What's people about? taking chances in life, you know, even though they know their position, like, it could take their life forever. Oh, but, I'll buy, I'll buy you know what I'm leader. saying? They still take some chances, you know what I mean? Even right. though it may be their last man. All right, let's see how they gonna play right. this. How you playing this? A construction Tim steps in the puddle with piss on a young thug's face. We focus in. He yells out shit. Jumps in the whip with a crip named Rick. They about to do some shit. If everything goes well, they be sitting on some stacks. If they plan shall fail, well they going back uh, to the penitentiary. You played this game already. It's hood legendary, like Captain Crunch berries. Money is the motive, so all guns is loaded and they rolling to your spot. Cause we heard y'all was holding. Uh, they going for that guap without. Notice and you notice Niggas to tie your babies up in the stroller So stop playing games Get your hands off these controllers Us dudes try and eat So we blow up and explode what? It's winter in New York Homeboy and it's cold You seen the codes when he spoke The words using math It was executive produced By my yellow skinny ass Bottom up records yeah. coming out on bottom up records You know oh, what I'm saying buy, buy You can go to shot You go to MySpace Forward slash I ain't the man child S-H-Y-H-E-I-M T H E M A N C H I L D, and you know what I'm saying. You can check it out. And Leave a message, son. They, they can play, play the game. Yeah. And they can put their own thoughts in it. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna spit a game, man. It's about death, man. Some talk to the archangel of death like this, All right. man. Know what I mean? Okay, Take yeah. everybody, the people love, everybody, this. people care about, yo. First you take my cousin Tawana, Tony Reagan, now swim Def, I don't respect you, why not you take me like you took him And fuck all that singing so hard to say goodbye Cause I ain't leaving and I don't give a freak about what you try Your bullets fly past my ears, I can hear them whistling Can't even fuck off them without becoming the next AIDS victim The style's disgusting, may the Lord cut your wings off And leave you in an infection, bleeding and pussing Since an adolescent I was suicidal I must have got possessed of nights in my bed shit Cause it was like I couldn't stand the Bible I seen what you did to my Aunt Betty when I signed a vital and I see you. He made sure she didn't pull through. You're so spiteful and cruel. Little poo ain't deserve to get murked. A rifle blue hay with brains all over the curb. Fire dirt, that's the only way out. A friend, you can have my soul or something you and the reaper never grab. I stick with the mag. My toe ain't got no tag. Body in no bag. It's like I probably died and came back. They said it was the dust, but I blame you for drowning a goon in that pool. Pushing Pete on them tracks. Giving cancer to sacks. You took my cousin David and Max. Makes time he deals so from I'm paranoid, you swallow those cracks My lines ain't flat, in fact, I'ma stay right here On Staten Island, Stapleton don't violate my square When death is nasty, it's straight in the eye Listen here, motherfucker, all today, God Williams will not die, die Uh, I mean, uh, I'ma play that play game, game I'ma play man. that, I'ma play Just that Boy, I, 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 I bet a lot of kids gonna play these games, man yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying, yeah. you know you know, keep your games intact, don't let nobody borrow them, you know what I'm saying? Because you know your shit gonna be right. fucked by, by the time you get it back. Yeah. Keep it, you know what I'm saying, as a collection. It, yeah. <laughs> keep it as a collection because what? I remember games in Atari, uh, Super Nintendo, now yeah, they got a bunch I mean? of other shit now. Yeah, they used to have the Asteroids, you yeah. know what I mean? The Miss Pat Man, now yeah, they got the new yeah, shit, you yeah, know what I yeah, mean? But you can play up. whatever game you want. Yeah. Just make sure you take care of that. Yeah, yeah. Use your brain. Yeah, yeah, because you only got one man left. One man. Shit, bottom up. One. When I grew up in Staten Island, it was like, at a time when I got into hip hop, a lot of people freestyle, a lot of people didn't. Me personally, I wasn't a freestyle guy. I like to paint pictures, I like to paint pictures to this day, you know what I mean? So I like to sit down, take my time and create, you know what I'm saying? Eliel, guy on the other hand, that's his specialty. He freestyle all day, he can just go all day up the top of his head, and he's great at that. Just the dawn with that. Because I go on vibes. I spit the real and how I feel, and any vibe can come around me, I can flow with that. But I've been locked up all my life, you know what I mean? So I've been around people who've been locked up, and they used to have ciphers in the yard and all that. So I spit with them plenty of people back then for all my life, like all the years I've been locked up, you know what I mean? So to come around my people and rhyme is even more energy is better because I'm doing it for not just me, but for them too. So the vibe be crazy, you know what I mean? What's crazy, Staten Island, we're from, we're the fifth borough. You gotta take a boat and a bridge. So we're the fifth yeah, borough of New York City. But 
they kind of we're like the south of the city. Yeah, so yeah. it's like New York City kind of X us out. So that puts us in our own zone. They go Brooklyn, Bronx, Queens, Manhattan, yeah. Long Island, yeah, Jersey, Island. Connecticut. They leave Staten Island now. So naturally, we picked up our own instinct because we was like, yo, we we ourselves. We gonna be us. Be you. We gonna yeah. be us. You know what I mean? And the crazy thing within Staten Island, once you get within Staten Island, is neighborhoods that their styles is totally different. Me and Wu-Tang were from the same neighborhoods. The thing was, I was on Virgin Records. I was a minor at the time. I was signed, but I had to go through courts because of things that happened to Gary Coleman, so they wanted to make sure our minors get into this business. We had to make sure trust funds and everything of that nature be set up. So RZA produced on my album, you know what I'm saying? My first album, but I didn't get a chance to come out before Wu-Tang because it's just grown men. They dropped, they were successful. By the time I really came out, it was like, they bring me. But I was already in my situation. You know what I mean? Me and Wu-Tang didn't officially do business to my third album. But, you know, they was the Beatles of hip hop and I got kind of sucked up underneath them. But, I, you know, I, I still contribute to the big picture, but I came as my own boss from the beginning. Right now, I just released the single Fat Boy, you know what I'm saying? This record towards Raekwon, you know what I'm saying? Um, Raekwon disrespected me, I felt, so I disrespected him back. It's not about a Wu-Tang beef, you know what I'm saying? It's just that, like, I always did my own thing anyway, you know what I mean? So, I just hope people don't take it personal, you know what I mean? Because, you know, they all Wu-Tang Clan, but a spade is a spade. You disrespect, you get disrespected. I think the me and Raekwon beef is beautiful from hip hop. I think, you know, it's, it's like David and Goliath. Yeah. You know, let's go. You know what I mean? It, it, I, you know, it's all fun and fun and love. I don't feel no hatred. Well, I was upset, and that's what bring it out of me to come at him like that, but that's hip hop. Yeah. Hip hop, you, you, that's what you vibe off. Like, every diss record came from a disrespect that one MC felt the other MC did, and that brings out the best of both MT, MCs sometimes. So, I think it may be needed for hip hop, it may have been needed for Wu Tang to say, hey man, we need to pull together and get our shit right. Because the youth that was under us then flipped on us, so we ain't teach right. Because obviously we're not showing and proving because we're dysfunctional. So I have to step away from that and do me. You know what I'm saying? I, in my heart, I will always be Wu Tang. I will always love Wu Tang, love the material, love the albums. You know what I'm saying? Personally, me and the rest of the clan is beautiful. Like, I, I, I show them respect, they show me respect. It's just this one dude disrespected. So that's that.